Day two, Lollapalooza. It's Modern Rock 98.7. We're in the media tent. I'm hanging out with Ryan and Andrew from Group Love. What's up, fellas? What's going on? How hanging, are you? Hanging next to this tree. Yeah, we're doing this uh, little under the tree. Have you ever seen Between Two Ferns? Yes. Okay, this you're, is... You're between two blondes right now. I'm between two blondes here <laughs> under the tree at Lollapalooza. Uh, this is not your first go-round at Lollapalooza, though. Am I correct? Second go around, uh, two years ago we played, it was great, and uh, have high hopes for today, as long as Andrew doesn't screw the whole thing up. Andrew, are, do you have anything planned that's just going to ruin today's set? I'm trying my first front flip. First front flip off of a drum riser. Yeah, they brought a little mini diving board, actually. <laughs> uh, you guys were recently in Myrtle Beach. You played a, a show at the House of Blues there, and I know you guys are getting ready to head out on the Honda Civic Tour with Portugal the Man. Are you excited about that? Absolutely. It's going to be a psychedelic affair, I think. We were hanging out with them yesterday. They're good friends of ours. They're really good guys. And uh, yeah, we saw them the other night. They played an after show over with uh, Royal Blood. And it's funny, we have this whole setup here and, and everybody just tries to walk, tries through. To walk through. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's great. Next time someone tries, I'm going to just like just, give them one slap in the just face. Go, you take one more step and I'm going to knock Group Love you is going right to beat up. your ass. Group Love is just going <laughs> to stomp a mud hole in your ass and walk that some bitch dry. <laughs> Oh, Feel, that, got, that got really dirty. <laughs> Feel free to use that. Right. Uh, what time are you guys on today? 4.45. 4.45, and I believe you are on the Bud Light stage. The big guy, the big one. Yeah, that's the big one. Uh, so what do, you, do you have anything like, do you like playing the big stages like that? I mean, there's so many people there, but, it, but you know, I guess it's kind of like a good feeling because you're playing to a lot of people even though it's not that close, you know? Well, we st we make sure that we get close at some point during the set, whether it's at the end if you know we just jump into the crowd, or uh, Christian and Hannah go down there and talk, you know, grab some people, and uh, we, we we make it intimate, even if it's not. You you force the intimacy on the crowd. Yes, forced intimacy is always the way to go. <laughs> yeah, his poor you should see his poor girlfriends. <laughs> <laughs> that's the way it always is. Uh, that's the way it is for me too. You have to force them to be intimate. <laughs> Uh, you guys are doing the press thing, and then you play it at 4:45. Are you going to have any time to see any music today at all? Uh, yeah, we'll see something, some stuff after we play. But then we have another show tonight where we're just joining our friends, Young the Giant, uh, for some covers and some shenanigans on stage at, at the, their show later tonight. So, you got a favorite cover that you do? We 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 right now we have uh, Beyonce "Drunken Love" in the rotation, nice. and uh, secret one coming. Yeah. We got a secret one. Uh, or I think we're gonna do sabotage. No, really, yeah. Beastie Boys, nice. Any uh, any Neil Diamond, the Jewish Elvis? Do you break them out? Uh, that's that's for like our acoustic sets that we just <laughs> play to each other. Okay. All right, so Lollapalooza Group Love is playing today, and then uh, when does the Honda Civic Tour actually start? Uh, a couple of weeks from now in uh, Seattle. Okay, do you get to enjoy a little bit of time off in between? Nope. No, just uh, grinding it out, right? I mean that's the problem. You have so many hit singles that uh, that's you just in high demand. <laughs> um, well, I appreciate the the compliment, <laughs> and uh, we're just happy to be doing what we're doing. Yeah, it's it's a it's a blessing to be a working musician and being able to play your music well, in front in, of people. In, I think in the music business in general is a but it's like what what else? I mean, it's the best the best uh, medium there is. is it music. is. I mean, it's not 82 anymore, so it's not all about the strippers and cocaine, but, uh, you know, it's still it's still a good racket if you can do it, if you have the means. It's kind of still about the strippers and cocaine. Yeah. Well, there you go. I stand corrected. It's, it is all about the strippers and cocaine at the end of the day. Guys, thank you so much. I hope you... Uh, you know, I hope you don't have to work too hard today. I hope that you get to uh, get a little bit of rest and relaxation in before you play. Uh, us too, but you know what? It's going to be a great show. It's going to be a big <laughs> crowd, and we're thankful. We'll, we'll have a. a well, I, I can't. I don't. I can't string a sentence together anymore. You're making me nervous. <laughs> I don't mean to make you nervous. It's the it's the forced intimacy. I do it all the time. <laughs> uh, guys, uh, again, for anybody that doesn't have, I'm with you. They need to get out there and get it, and that's the current single too. So. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming to Lollapalooza and for talking to us. I mean, you're going to come play for all these people. You might as well talk to a little less in uh, Wilmington, North Carolina, you know? I love it. We love the Carolinas, and we love you. All right. Well, we love you back. Come on back and see us sometime soon. Day two, Lollapalooza, hanging out with Group Love. It's Modern Rock 98.7.